Good morning again. This is Eric, Northwest Bus Sales. All right, here we go. Let's start another one. What we got here, 1996 MCI 102D3. 102 inch wide. D is the model. Three, well that means three axles. 102D3. All right, 47 passenger, 40 footer. 40 foot motor coach. Let's check her out inside. Pardon the rain. She sure is raining cats and dogs today. I'll tell you what. Look at it. I'll tell but that's how woo, pardon me. That's how we like it up here in the Pacific Northwest. We're a bit webbed foot up here. Okay, here we go. Driver's seat right here. Check out the driver's upholstery. Tip top shape. Alright, armrest as well. Believe it or not, they all don't have that, especially dueling armrest, no less. All right, tilt telescoping wheel, a lot of your typical coach features, as you always hear me say. Uh, let's see, oh, check it out. Allison B500, six-speed automatic transmissions. Okay, driver and passenger heat and AC as always. Got some pull-down sunshades there for the driver, windshield and side window there. Uh, let's see. Uh, it looks like the glass seems to be in pretty good shape as well, from what I can tell. Glass is in real good shape, the windshields. All right. Here's a control panel over here. Yeah, she's got a hole in the dash there, but pardon me, I'm not sure why we don't have a, a CD player in there. But nonetheless, if that's something you require, we'd be happy to get that in there for you, I believe. Don't hold me to it. I'll have to check with my sales manager. But either way, it's got... Uh, also has televisions in it here as you can tell got four TVs in it but it does not have the video system to go along with it again that is something we can definitely accommodate you on all right check out the passenger upholstery here primo shape I'm gonna have to I'm gonna go out on a limb here and say these are recent seat covers just by the look of them they look real good headrests the seat cushions and everything aren't all broke down and anyhow they look pretty sweet Floor shows pretty good as well. We've got open overhead parcel racks. You, know, you can see the reading lights and what have you. AC vents and all of that. Big tour style windows with tint. Passenger glass is all in pretty doggone good shape as well. Restroom in the rear. Toilet. No sink. Vanity mirror. There's the blue light special up there. I'm not sure what that blue light indicates. I'm gonna have to check on that, but anyhow, reclining passenger seats with armrests, foot rests there you can see, and headrests as well. Okay, like I said, floor's in good shape. Overall, pretty clean bus inside and out. Okay, let's walk around her outside a little bit. Oh, also has a destination sign. Destination sign, check that out. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, air horn down here. Look at that. <laughs> Woo! I like air horns. Okay, dual entry grab bars. Actually, four grab bars as you come in. Let's check out the tire tread on this baby. Look at that. Good tread there on the front. Mm-hmm. Let's open up some of these luggage areas as well. I previously did a, undone the airlocks inside before I started the video, so but these do have the locking capability. Look at that. That right there is a doggone uh, uh, extra fuel tank right there. All right. Battery box down in here. It's got the, uh, check it out, a couple of ADs in here, master switch and what have you. Some road hazard triangles. Fuel door right here. 200 in 72 gallon capacity this baby will go to the doggone east coast and back well okay maybe not that far but nonetheless she's got a lot of doggone range on her okay it's got three luggage bays underneath now i know what you're thinking this back one's a little small it's a little more narrow than a than another than a dl but that's because a dl is a 45 footer not a 40. so you are losing a little bit of luggage area there Tread there on the drive tires on the passenger side. We can get a look at the end of the carriage of it. All right. Perfect. We do have some slight 
damage underneath there, just a tish. Not too terribly bad. Structurally, she's tip top. More tag axle as well. This looks to be, uh, from what I understand, it's been a West Coast bus so have I. By the looks of the undercarriage here, it shows it is well. All right, let's cruise around the back here. I'm going to mix it up a little bit today. We're going to go with a British accent. Look at this. Gosh, goodness sakes, I tell you what, it, she's got a wonderful exterior paint. Let's look at the mail. Look at that. What we've got here is Detroit Diesel Series 60. It's an 11.1 litre. Litre. That's right, 11.1 litres. That goes along with my British accent today as well, is the litres, because, you know, we wouldn't want to talk in standard increments anymore. We used to go by cubic inches, but... Nonetheless, here's the tyres. Good tread there on the passenger side, rear drives, and the tag axle as well. Oh, uh, yes, body and paint is chipped off. Look at that. I love the black dirt windows, goes well. I want to say this baby's been recently painted also. Okay, here we go. Well, let's check out the front tread here. On the driver's side rear tire. She's got good tread all the way around. All the way around. Clearance lights up top there. Good looking coach. All right. I think that'll just about do it. Once again, it's a 1996 MCI 102D3. That's a 40 foot motor coach, 47 passengers. Uh, I think that'll do it again. Uh, pardon me, I'm drawing a bit of a blank right now. Uh, 1996 MCI 102D3. I know I already said that. Please check us out online at nwbus.com. Please call with any questions, 800-231-7099. Thanks.